All right, take a look at your screen. We want to introduce you to Jacob Thompson. He's a nine year old and he's battling stage four cancer. He, like a lot of children, has a wish, but his wish is to get Christmas cards sent early to celebrate his holiday in a hospital room in Maine. And that wish, as you can imagine, has been granted by people across the world, even here in Southwest Florida. Fox 4's parenting blogger Meredith Masony is here to tell us about taking that little boy's message and kind of create it, turning it into a learning experience for your children. So what is the, the learning, what's the lesson for your children? I, you know, I think most kids' favorite holiday is Christmas. Sure. And when I ran across this story last week on Friday, I went to talk to my kids about that because as, as parents we're raising, we want to raise caring adults. And empathy is something that sometimes kids don't have. And so you have to talk to them about that and really discuss the importance of feeling for somebody, not just feeling sad for them, but feeling the way they are feeling. And so I wanted to take some time and so we shared the story out and I saw um, you know, a lot of news outlets had picked it up and so it, it picked up steam and Arnold Schwarzenegger sent a card, one of the wow. Teen, teen Titan Go um, actors. So it's been fantastic but we have to take the time to make sure that our kids understand empathy and being caring human beings, supporting one another. All right, and how do you separate that from the just feeling sorry from some, for someone and then actually feeling the empathy for them? Um, I think you just do your best to model that behavior. As a mother of three, you know, I, I've not been in, in Jacob's mom's shoes, but I can tell you that my heart breaks for her. And so I sat down and just had a really open conversation about what it's like to, to have those feelings or the feels as we call them in our home. Do you have the feels? And my kids, you know, wanted to send cards, so we did. And Jacob received 14,000 cards on Monday to his hospital room. That is incredible. Um, I, any parent that hears a story like that or sees a story like that is going to be impacted. How does Jacob's story impact you? It, it broke my heart. I reached out to my community on social media. It was shared thousands and thousands and thousands of times. People have been sending in pictures of making Jacob. He's, his motto is live like a penguin. Hmm. And because penguins stand together and penguins have fun and penguins are cool. And so everybody has been sending him gifts of handmade knitted penguin scarves and putting up pictures of their cards that they've handmade and all of these wonderful things. And I think as a mom that shows to me, it, it makes my heart happy to know that there are good people out there. Absolutely. So I know people want to get involved. So how can they help Jacob? Uh, you can mail cards right here to him. Uh, there, it's it's not too late. Go ahead and send them in. Send the Christmas wish to them. And they did let they did let us know through a Facebook message that any other gifts that were sent would also be donated to the other kids in the hospital as well. Oh, so they're going to sh you know share the wealth and pay it forward. And that's what the mom asked that we do as well, is continue to pay it forward. And I'm sure people can find out much more information on your Facebook page, right? Yep, the, I, the, the article, there's another post going up later on tonight. I'm trying to keep my community informed and you can also find it, I, I would assume, on your website yeah. here. Yeah, fox4now.com. Meredith, thank you very much. We'll see you next week. Thank